Okay, so I decided to vlog today because I keep putting up stuff on my Instagram like asking you guys what sort of videos you want me to make and I get so many people every single time swiping up being like do more vlogs like I enjoy your vlogs I don't do anything ever I literally do the exact same thing every single fucking day and it's really messing with my mental health but I can't do anything about it because our country won't come out of lockdown Ireland is the country that has been in lockdown the longest out of every single other country in the world just let me live my life oh. And now I know I'm gonna get these Karens in the comments being like, Lauren, people are dying. I know people are dying. That's why I'm abiding by the restrictions. But it's really messing with my head. Sorry, I don't, I don't really know what happened there. But I've been up for a couple of hours now. And I was just feeling really unmotivated. Like I haven't had any motivation to like get up and make a YouTube video because YouTube videos usually take like the whole day and like take a good bit of planning. Like I'm not used to that. I make TikToks which are like max a minute long. You know, not 10 minutes long. But um, I decided to watch Emma Chamberlain's new video and she just inspires me. Like, I love that girl. Her and Olivia Neal, Flossie as well. I love Lewis. Like, they just really inspire me. It's really annoying as well because, like, I'll always plan to make a video. Like, say, I have been planning to make, um, like, a summer outfit haul, basically, um, for a couple of weeks now and I've been adding stuff to my basket to buy to make the video. And Olivia Neal put up a video like that, like, last week. And now everyone thinks I just copy Olivia Neal and I'm not doing it on purpose. She probably does, I probably do unintentionally copy her all the time. I just realised you can see all the blood and pus that came out of my spot I popped this morning. I'm so sorry. But yeah, I have a couple of things I need to do today. Um, I'm basically finished college, but um, well, I'm not really finished. I still have lectures this week, but I don't really have to go to them because they're just revision ones. Like next week I have um, my exams for the end of the year. So I'm going to do a little bit of studying. I might show you how I study. That might be interesting. Might make a cute study montage. Um, I'm going to clean my wardrobe and then I might just decide to cook some dinner for the family because my dad's working very late all the time now, starting a new job. My mom works very late and she works very hard. Not very late. She like does regular hours, but like it's long. My brother does absolute sweet fuck all and gets away with everything, but anyways, I don't do anything all day. He comes home from school, at least he has school, like I don't do anything, so I might as well just cook. But I don't even know what there is to cook. And my kitchen isn't that nice, so it's not gonna be very aesthetically pleasing, but anyways. <laughs> so there's no point in me wearing something actually nice. This is from Sheen, these are from Sheen and they're slightly see-through so I will not be shaking my ass today. Actually no, I still probably will. Socks, fluffy thick socks from Pennies. Calvin Klein sliders. I hate myself. <laughs> Whenever I curl my hair, I never like it like when I actually just do it. It's always like nicer the day after, like when I sleep in it. And it's just always look nicer. I don't know. Like, why does that... <laughs> so basically, my mom just came home on our lunch break there and I just had tomato soup and bread and butter for lunch. Nothing extravagant at all. And now I'm just going to sit and do a little bit more shopping. Like, I feel like I'm making like a really big deal out of this video, but I want it to be a good video and I want to make sure all the clothes I buy are like nice clothes that I'm actually going to wear. Because I have this habit of like just buying things just because I'm like oh that's nice but then I realise I'm never ever going to wear it and I don't have anything to wear it with or wear it to. So I'm just gonna sit here on my phone on my bed doing some shopping and hopefully place the orders today and then afterwards I'm going to rearrange my wardrobe. Not even rearrange just like clean it up because it's in bits. So yeah, I'm probably gonna sit here for the next two hours and obviously you don't want to see that so I'll talk to you all later. Hey! So I've been sat on my bed for approximately, apparently, like two hours. And I managed to spend 
about 400 euro but I want to spend like a little bit more um <laughs> what's wrong with me um I just want to spend like a little bit more well it's not that I want to spend I want to buy a couple of more things um because I was gonna buy a load of stuff off, off of I saw it first but they never have my sizes ever like nothing I want is ever 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 in my size it's ridiculous I don't like anyways um, so I'm gonna try and look on Nasty Gal and see if they have any nice things um, and maybe Zara but like I always try to look on Zara and like you can never find anything actually nice like there's probably some really nice things like hidden but 99% of Zara clothes are really ugly but I want to find all the nice stuff that everyone seems to find but I can just never find anyways we're gonna go make some mashed potatoes because I'm having stew tonight and there's only a couple of mashed potatoes left for the stew so I'm gonna make more stew stew potatoes trying to do a potato mashing tutorial. Hey guys, I did nothing absolute sweet fuck all like I got really into the mood to vlog today and then I just like didn't have anything to do and that's the problem like I don't want to film stuff that like is not entertaining at all basically everything I've done since I mashed those potatoes for my stew was eat my stew make two tiktoks post the two tiktoks and then I sat on my bed and did nothing so because of this, I have decided I am going to continue this vlog tomorrow. For the rest of the night, I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy my lint Easter egg that my boyfriend got me and a cup of tea. And I'll see you all tomorrow, good night. Well, it's not really tomorrow, but like, it's tomorrow for me. Um, good night, I love you all. Ayo. I s oh, that is really, really wonky. Hold on, let me start that again. Ayo. I slept in check. But, thankfully, I woke up in time to get Olivia Neal's edit on Motel Rocks. And I was gonna buy more things from her edit, but fuck me, Motel Rocks is expensive. I got like two bits from her edit and like a pair of jeans that were on sale. Um, because like, I can't stop buying stuff. Quarter to 12 and um, I'm just gonna have a very quick breakfast and then I'll show you my workout routine kind of, actually I'm not really going to go into detail because I don't even know if my routine works so there's no point in me like going into detail with my workout routine because I don't think it's actually doing anything. It just makes me feel a little bit better about myself, you know, it makes me feel like I actually did something. Fitness check. I've stopped doing that. I haven't done a workout properly in about two weeks so I'm not going to do that much because I will break a hip. I'm gonna do a bit of work with my resistant band. I don't know where I got this, I just found it in my wardrobe. I'm here. Ugh. I have these. I actually bought these for my brother for Christmas, but I bought them so I could use them too because smart investments. It's only about like 30 kg altogether, so it's really not that heavy at all. But it comes with this bar and basically you can attach it to the middle of either of them and it'll make it, you know, one of those bars. What are they called? What are they called? Parallel bars? You know what I mean? One that people would be doing the squatties with, you know what I mean? Oh, that was a horrible squat. My workouts usually take about 45 minutes. This one might be a half an hour because I really haven't done anything in about two weeks and I probably will pass out. So um, enjoy that. short one but I can feel like the muscles in my leg ripping so I probably shouldn't keep going. Usually I will like, put the bars together and I'll do like some hip thrusts and proper squats and deadlift squats um, 
but I do not want to like damage my legs and also I haven't been eating enough so if I work out too much I'll just lose weight and I want to gain it so <sighs> I'm so unfit listen to my fucking breath I hate my body check Something that I find like really annoying is like whenever I talk about my body and like my like insecurities I have with my body on TikTok or on anything, I always get so many comments from people being like, you're literally the beauty standard, blah, 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 you, you shouldn't be complaining, you're skinny, you shouldn't be complaining. And I'm just like, everyone has insecurities no matter what their body type is. And really I do not have the beauty standard body, like I have absolutely no curves. Most of the comments that I get about my body are like, in fairness, it is like little boys, so I shouldn't really be that like offended by it, but it has affected me. Like little boys being like, you have the body of a boy, blah, 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 flat as a pancake, I could do my ironing on you. And I'm like, thanks. Okay, my point is, everyone has insecurities no matter what their body type is. Just because you might want someone's body doesn't mean that person with that body doesn't have insecurities about their body too, okay? Love and positivity. Hey queens, so it's like six o'clock right now and I had food at three o'clock and basically I had a big huge bowl as you saw in those clips of pesto pasta and rashers if you're from America it's bacon and then I had a huge bread roll afterwards this is what we call the pasta belly <laughs> she wasn't taking care of myself so I don't really have much else to do today but I'm going to rearrange my well, I'm not gonna rearrange I'm just gonna clean it up um, I think I'm gonna rearrange it or like just make space when all of my new clothes come in that I've ordered. I'm planning on ordering more again tonight, so. It's gonna be a really big haul anyways, and it'll be a really good video. But this is what my wardrobe is looking like at the moment. Like it's not really messy, like I just, I don't have enough hangers for everything. And these are like all the wardrobe, or wardrobe, these are all the tracksuit sets I bought recently. I just do not have any room for them. This is my like second side of the wardrobe. So I was thinking of maybe clearing some space up here just to put some stuff and clearing these because these are just like random bits of clothes that I might use if I was like knew I was gonna get dirty if I was painting or something like that everything's a bit all over the place all right I have a cup of tea and I'm ready to tackle my wardrobe It's just so much like a more appealing to the eye. So yeah, I didn't really change anything around. I just made space for my, so those are my tracksuit sets there. Those are just regular hoodies, tracksuit bottoms, and then those are like other like crew necks I don't actually have any hangers for yet, but I will hang them up down here when I get more hangers. And then I just took that basket that was down at the bottom and I put my shoes back in. I'm actually, I bought another pair of Jordans and they should be here next week, so I'm really excited. I'm just gonna end this vlog here because I really don't think you want to watch me study. And to be honest, I'm probably not even gonna study. I don't wanna put myself through that mental trauma. So I'm just gonna end the vlog here. I know this is kind of like all over the place and it was over like two days, but a lot of you were asking for more vlogs and this is the most realistic vlog I could give you. I do not do anything unless it's like the weekend and then I see my granny and my boyfriend and maybe go for coffee. But anyways, I really do hope you enjoyed and the next video is going to be so much better, I promise. It's going to be a big summer outfit haul, try on haul and you're going to get to see everything that I bought and everything that I will be wearing this summer and hopefully you can get some outfit inspiration and yeah, I love you all and I'll see you in the next video.